Now, the other day, when you lot watched this, um, I reviewed uh, Brewdog Black Art, yeah? Well, when I went into the Tesco's to buy it, I found this. Brewdog Mr. President Def Defiant Double IPA. Now, I know it's been out a while, but I picked it up because I wanted to know if it stunk of the president, Joe Biden. Because I've got this thing in my head that if anybody stands next to Joe Biden, he smells of piss. So, have Brewdog made a defiant double IPA? Fuck me, 9.2! Nine point two. What's it say on the can? A beer destined for greatness. Now, um, I don't know how long this has been out. Uh, I I had a quick look on this thing called YouTube. Uh, I don't know if any of you have heard of YouTube. It's a very very nice place. There is there's no backstabbing. There's no moaning. There's no crying. There's no whinging. There's no nothing like that. Everybody on YouTube, especially in the beer community, all get on like this. Hand in hand, dancing down the meadows, in the flowers, with the butterflies, in the nice weather. Everybody gets on with each other. It's a fucking great place. So anyway, I've seen some reviews and like some of the reviews are four years old and all that. So this is completely new to me. Um, <sighs> fucking hell, 9.2. 9.2 sounds like a bloody gymnastic score. So. Slow it down, Dave. Slow it down, slow it down, slow it down, slow it down. Oh, for fuck's sake, it's too much in there. There's your, there's your thumb now. Mm. Pine. Pine, I'm getting pine. <clears throat> Excuse me. Now that looks a good colour. In my book, I don't know about anything as such of beers, but that looks a good colour. My dad would say that looks a bit like pedigree or something like that. Not the wrestling move, the pedigree, where Triple H hooks your arms up and then drops you on your face while he farts on you and drops his ball bag on the back of your head. This just tastes like a normal fucking load of piss water. That gin, June. Oh, what? Do you think this smells of Joe Biden? I've never sniffed it. No, but the worst thing get Joe Biden sniffed a lot of people though, isn't it? He'd sniff your hair. He might have done about uh, thirty-five years ago. Yeah, why were you? How old Dirty you? old screw. I was gonna say, how old were you then? Fifteen or something. No, twenty, I'd be. So now you'd have been too old for him then. <laughs> oh, that's made me do a proper dither. Do <laughs> oh, like when I did the electric that, boogaloo? That, worked, that went straight through me bobbit. <sighs> Fuck's sake. No. I mean, it's got, look, it's got a good two finger head. Oh, it's got the two fingers from me. It, it smells of pine, doesn't it? It smells of toilet cleaner, doesn't it? It's like you used to walk into a gents and they got those little fucking things in the urinals. Apparently people used to pinch them, piss on them, pinch them, and because they were warm they could sniff them and they got a fucking hit. Why don't they just put them up in the little tap? Oh, I don't fucking know. I suppose the urine makes it a bit like the tanners back oh. in the day. Let's, uh, let's sup in. drink that that is <laughs> just fucking awful it just, I don't understand how people can sit there and drink this and say oh I'm getting the mango I'm getting the citra I'm getting the but it's fucking horrible I am 
sure people drink this crap just for the sake of it. What's in it? It includes cereal, water, malt, barley, hops, yeast, Zuta, 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 did he? Zuta and play for Sweden. <laughs> it's fucking horrible. I honestly don't understand how people can. Do you know what these breweries do? They just buy any old shit, put it in a, <laughs> put it in a fucking big. Do you like it, eh? Like it, it's fucking horrible. I tell you what, I'd rather sit here and have that fucking conservatory door open, letting all the cold in. Oh, shut up, buddy. <clears throat> Cheers! June, come and have another sip. No. Come on. No. Come and have another sip. I don't want to. Come and let me watch your dither again. You're going to shut up, right? Don't drink it, it's mild. I'm going to drink it. There's not many things that I don't finish. What's supposed to be in it? Ah, oh, fuck those. Mr Sheen, I reckon. It is in it! June's going... <laughs> <laughs> please, please, people. You beer tubers, right? <laughs> you beer tubers with your little channels that think you're all fucking brilliant. Just please, put in the comments down below what you... What is it? How can anybody really happily sit there and think, hmm, that is really, really good? I'm going to fucking message Scott and see what he says. Right, where is he? I bet he's not. I bet he's walking that dog. Right. What? Right. Right, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Scott. I'm reviewing Brew Dogs, Mr. President. Is it as bad as I think it is? I'll wait a couple of minutes just to see if you reply, but I think it's like drinking toilet cleaner. Let's see if he gets it. Let's see if I get blue ticks. You should have told him he's live on, on YouTube. Live from the London Palladium. I'm just saying, if you're live on YouTube, please do not swear. Yeah. See if he sends a message. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, answer me. Answer me, answer me. Come on. Where are you? Oh, he's not going to answer, is he? There's Babs easing about somewhere. That's gonna be wind. Yeah, it's bad, isn't it? I just honestly don't understand how people can drink that. I don't, I don't, I can, I can, right. It's like when people, um, young people start drinking whiskey and you start with the Bells because you think <coughs> Bells is the popular one to have. Bells whiskey. And um, you do it and then you, you get it and you think, Ugh! Yeah, don't you? But then you realise that if you go on to all the whiskies, you think more refined whiskies, you get you get a better taste and you understand and you appreciate what the whisky is. This, I just don't understand. I don't understand how anybody can drink this and think this is good. It's got a good head still. It's got a good head. Come on, where are you, you fucking muppet? Not going to answer, is it? Fucking horrible. Really bad. Um, no doubt Scott's reviewed it. No doubt fucking Dean's Beer Reviews has reviewed it as well. Just pop over there and see what they say. But I honestly don't understand how anybody can drink that and fucking enjoy it. I, I just don't get it. I don't, the, the people who drink this and think it's nice, you, your fucking taste buds must be dead. You, they've got to... Uh, Covid has killed your fucking taste buds. 
I mean, look at it. It looks really good, don't it? It really does. If that was in the pub and you were drinking that, and you, I mean, how long have I had this going? Right, 10 minutes. So this is like eight minutes old, seven minutes old. And it's still got good life. It's still got bubbles, look. Bubbles. Not Michael Jackson's bubbles. Come on, Harris. No, he ain't gonna answer. He ain't gonna answer. <sighs> That's fucking horrible. Oh well. It's fucking disgusting. I don't know how anybody can drink it. Um, right, we'll leave that one there then. I don't know how much it was. Oh, fucking never buying it again. Hey? I'm never going to buy that again. No, no, never. So, uh, oh well, he's not going to answer. So, he's probably fell out with me over WhatsApp. Dangerous place, what's that? Things get misinterpreted. Oh, he's here, hold on, he's online, he's online. Right, I'm doing a review. See, we're all waiting, anticipation. <laughs> he's typing, he's tipping. I'm gonna tell him it's fucking horrible. Let's hear from the expert. One of the many experts of beer on the YouTube. He's typing, he's still typing. I bet his phone's going click, 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 click. Yeah. I haven't had Mr. President for a long time, mate. It used to be under the Tesco range. I seem to remember it being 9%, ain't it? You fucking idiot. Right, was it any good? Uh, I didn't mind it back in the day like posh tramp juice. Would you buy it again? Let's see what he says. It's quite funny this, isn't it? He's typing, he's typing. He's tippy tip 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 tippy tip 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 tip. Well he's not doing that because he's doing it on his phone. Would you buy it again? Come on. I'd buy it again, as haven't had it in ages. Wouldn't pay four pound for it. You for it though, mug. A oh, four fucking quid. Yeah, he says, Mr. President, it's £4 a can. Oh, for fuck's sake. Right. Don't fucking go in Tesco's and buy that. Because it's not worth it. Fucking nowhere near is that worth that. For fuck's sake. He's put, that's the brew dog beer, yeah? I've said, for fuck's sake, yes, it is. May as well drink Joe Biden's piss. For 
<laughs> See, that's what WhatsApp, well, that's what WhatsApp messages should be, like that, just twatting around, arsing about, messing about. No fucking Matt Hancock being a complete scary cunt. Oh, shit. I said, cunt. At four pound a can, I want the revenue back off this. I better beep that bit out. Right, it says it used to be used to be in this. Now it's in a Star Spangled can, and he's right. Look, that's what he, that's what it used to be in. Fucking shit! It's shit! It's shit! Right, we'll finish that one there, then, folks. Thank you for joining me and Scott of Scott and Wonders World. Get over to his channel and have a look at his channel. Very entertaining sometimes, sometimes. He does these little videos with Wanda where uh, she's cooking and she don't speak. Very good. Very, um... What's the word I'm looking for? Eh? Informative. Now he's told me to... He's just told me Palm Beach, Brewdog's Palm Beach is vomit beer. So get over to Scott's channel and go and look at his Palm Beach um, video. Uh, vomit beer. Fucking hell. Mad. Right, folks. Ladies. Um, I've just had a message from Scott. And apparently the last time he drank uh, Mr. President, he was drinking it in a field doing handstands or headstands or handstanding on his head. Um, if that's what it does to you, I personally would definitely leave it alone. The last thing you want to see is a beer man, a beard man, standing on his head in a field like a totem pole. Um, it, it, it's just unbelievable. If that's, if, I mean, 9.2, there is no way you can enjoy that. But I suppose when you look at it, at 9.2%, and you're drinking it in a field, and it's making you do handstands or headstands or standing on his head, then there might be something in it. There might be something there that people might want. If it makes you feel happy and gives you a buzz and give you a warm glow inside so you forget all your troubles, it might be the thing to do. Could Brew Dogs, Mr. President, be a boost? It's one to think about, folks. But not for very long. <laughs> but not for very long, says June, baby. Laters.